Hi everyone, I'm Tom with the Epson Moverio team here with another tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to sideload the latest DJI GO and DJI GO 4 apps for your Moverio BT300 FPV Drone Edition. The DJI GO app is available through the Moverio apps market. The version on the market is the latest one optimized for Moverio. However, you may see updates to DJI GO on Android or iPhone platforms before they hit Moverios. Every app on the Moverio apps market is tested and approved before it is released. This additional testing period helps us prepare Epson phone support teams with any critical notes or bugs. If you want the latest Moverio tested DJI GO update, simply navigate to the Moverio apps market to install or update. However, if you are anxious to check out the latest DJI GO updates before they are approved for Moverio, I will now show you how to sideload the latest version of DJI GO. For those of you who already have DJI GO installed on Moverio, you may want to remove it to ensure a clean install. Simply go to the All Apps page, click on the app, and drag it to uninstall. The first step to sideloading will be changing your security options to allow for the installation of apps from third-party sources. If this is your first time sideloading an app, please watch our how-to video on sideloading. Remember, by installing any unapproved software, you are putting your device at risk. After you've changed the permissions, you'll want to install a QR code reader. I'll show you why in just a moment. Go to the Moverio Apps Market, find a QR reader. Install it and launch the program. Next, using a phone or PC, open a web browser and go to the URL in the notes section below this video. In that page, you will see a QR code. Put on your Moverio and use the QR code reader to scan that code. This will give your device a direct download link to the latest APK file for DJI GO 4. The APK file will download onto your device. Go to Downloads and find the file. Click and hold the file name to install it. If this version of DJI GO 4 gives you any problems, please uninstall it and reinstall the latest approved version through the Moverio Apps Market. We have more Moverio tutorials here and on our website. Please leave any questions and comments in the section below. Thanks for watching.